channel completely different angle today it is currently eight in the morning i have my hot chocolate kyron's finishing his cereal ada is down there a very rare appearance from ada and i thought i'd just say hi so we currently have the grinch on like the new one i quite like it the kids love it as well i also really like the old one kyron is terrified but we still watch it <laughs> He still wants to watch it, but obviously there's times where he just hides. I got up really early this morning, four o'clock I believe, done my skin routine. My skin is looking lovely and clean. My skin is glowing today, got my hair up. I'm so ready for this school run. Ada's not feeling very well today. She's got such a nasty cough that she just can't get rid of. So uh, I have a appointment book for her later at the doctor's and I've got no one to watch her while I take Karen to school so she's gonna have to come with me, bless her. Me and my mum go for breakfast every single morning while waiting for Karen to finish school because he's on a reduced timetable. So little miss is gonna come for breakfast with us. Ada, hi, hi darling. She's like, don't talk to me today. What you got? She never really sees me vlog because I try my hardest not to be on like my phone or vlog much around the kids. I want to spend as much time as possible with them. But I thought this morning, just give you a different approach, you can just see what our mornings are like. So yeah, like I said, Kyron's just had his breakfast. Hi! Here's Kyron. You excited for school? Yeah, I love to go to school. Good boy. So if you've been here a while... Oh. Excuse me, you're in the background making noises you'll know that Kyron absolutely loves trains he just has such an obsession with them I think that might be to do with his autism but anything to do with trains absolutely loves he's obsessed with the Polar Express and we're actually taking him on the real one tomorrow in Norfolk so that's going to be really really exciting he knows everything about Polar Express like as soon as he sees that golden ticket that they send you I know he's just gonna be so happy I'm, I'm not I'm gonna cry <laughs> I know I'm going to cry, but I'm just, obviously I'm going to vlog it all, which is going to be really exciting. Does anyone else feel like when you have a very early productive morning that it just sets you like up for the rest of the day? Because I feel like like this morning I've tidied the living room a bit, you don't want to look in the kitchen, that's just awful. But it's, it's nice to just come home to like a really cosy clean living room. <laughs> Thank you, darling. So Ada's all dressed, ready to go. Kyron is upstairs, he's now going to go get dressed. I'm gonna drop him off at school. Then me and Ada and my mum are gonna go out for breakfast. And then an hour and a half, yeah, hour and a half later, so literally quarter to 11, we pick him back up again. And I've got to crack on with the day. Hi everyone, so I am now back from Asda. Of course, I had a look around the George section and I may or may not have got more things than what I should have. But yeah, let's go get them. So firstly, I had to grab another one of these throws. We already have one on that sofa. So I want another one for the matching one just in front of me. Got Ada a little like princess plate. It was only a pound and she goes through these quite often. She just likes to throw her food onto the floor and sometimes she just breaks her plates. So a pound, you can't go wrong. So I started Christmas shopping and at the moment Ada is into stacking, lining up, building. There's only five pound and I thought that was just really good. I think she'll really enjoy these. I also got some Play-Doh. Didn't really have many color options, but yeah, these will do. I had to pick up one of these for my sister-in-law. She saw the one that I got a couple of weeks ago, a few weeks ago now, and they didn't have any until today. So I had to grab this for her. I know she'll be so happy. Don't know if this is my favorite, but look at this. It's like for snacks, it's just a lovely, plate and then I also got I also got a matching tea bag rest doesn't it just look amazing absolute favorite I think these are so cute so gorgeous I had to grab a tin of shortbread biscuits I just love the tin and they weren't very expensive either I check the receipt £4.25 for these I just look really nice on the dining table I had to get another candle it just looks really pretty I also got a tea light holder. That's super cute. Also got another candle. And that just smells amazing. It's so sweet. Of course, 
the wooden tops, which are my favorite. And then we did go above and beyond and get this from Danelm. It's a wood tree shaped platter. I think this was 10 pound, but I just absolutely love it. It just go perfectly on the side, just like sort of in the kitchen, length against the side. This might be my favorite. Yeah, I got quite a bit today. Oh my God, how can I forget? I got, oh, it's back to front, you can't see. Uh, it's reindeer gingerbread kit. So it'll be really interesting to see if they actually turn out like this. Hopefully they look nothing like the gingerbread house I did yesterday because that was just ridiculous. So I'm gonna add these presents to the Christmas bag. Find a new home for my gingerbread pieces. And yeah, I'll see you soon. So we actually got some new bubbles today from B&M. 51 for 15 pound. And these, thankfully, actually have the little tie things on. Um, yeah, because they're big. They are big ones. So we're going to pop them on the tree now. Yeah. 